Hello everyone, this is Diocletian. This is my first ever video on my channel, and I wanted to start it with one of my favorite games ever. It's called Sid Meier's Pirates. If you have never played it, I strongly recommend you play it. It's a little bit outdated, as you can see, 2005, but it holds up pretty well. It's, if you like Civilization, if you like Sid Meier and his games, I would 100% recommend this. I got this on Steam, I don't know how... It was like $10, I think. Maybe $5. It really wasn't um, cheap at all. But let's go right into it. I will let you see the intro. All right, let's find us a ship. I always liked that intro. When I was younger, it held up a lot better, but now that I'm older, <laughs> it definitely doesn't seem as realistic. Let's see. As you can see, I used to play Dota, but I think I'll change my name. Let's do Diocletian, because why not? It's the best emperor. And if you want to argue with me on that, um, go right ahead, because I will absolutely argue with you about that. Skill, I always do fencing because I find that that's really just useful. I could do wit and charm, get the lovely governor's daughters. Navigation, eh, I don't really care about that. Gunnery, usually in battles I'll go for ramming the ship, um, so that's not really useful. Medicine, I mean it'll extend my career, but what's the point? Like it'll, I don't even know how long it extends it to. And there are so many, um... Items you can get too that extend it already. It's like there's no real point, you know. So I usually go fencing, um, and here I kind of like all of these dates. I will usually do the war for profit. I don't. For me, it's like I don't usually like doing the default scenario. Whenever I get another option, I'll do the other ones. Like I tried out merchants and smugglers, the new colonists. I've done all of them really. Um, but I found that I just like the War for Profit. It's a nice mid-year um, throughout all of them. And it feels like it's sort of at the height of the pirates before they're starting to decline. And yeah, that's basically it. So let's go in. I think that's good. I usually go in Rogue. Um, I find it to be a bit easier. I can, I've can. i tried Swashblocker. It's so hard. So I'm just going to go in Rogue. And depending on how we do, um, we will decide when we divide the plunder whether or not to do swashbuckler. So let's get right into this. Now, you need to sign on as part of your crew. So we can do the English, the Dutch, the Spanish, or the French. So I don't really have a usual preference. I usually like to um, pick one that will put me up in... Like, by Hispaniola, that area. Like, uh, by the Bahamas, all that stuff. So, usually I'll pick the English. And the reason for that is there's a ton of cities, and that'll give me a ton of crew. 
And what I love to do in this game too is sack cities. So the more crew you have, the more likely you'll be able to overwhelm the city's garrison. So let's just do the English. All right, we sail with the tide. Oh, it was fraught with terror and cruelty. All right, I won't talk. <laughs> Go ahead and watch. Hmm. All right. Let's get into this. Before we do anything, let's change our name. Because I don't want to do the revenge. I'm a Roman emperor. I'm going to call it Imperator. I was thinking between Imperator and Tetrarch, but I think Imperator is cooler. I like that name. St. Kitts. Okay. Let's go to the tavern. See what's there for us. Welcome aboard, lads. Double their crew there. Yeah, I'm poor as hell, so I can't afford that. Well, hello there. A Dutch sloop bound for bound for Santo Domingo. Okay. Cool, cool. Governor of Nevis' daughter. Let's talk to the governor before we leave. Let's see what he has to say. My dear D Mr. Diocletian, please come in. I don't have a great English accent, but I can try, I guess. You may be interested to know that we are at war with the evil Spanish. We have a peace treaty with the French. I am pleased to offer a letter of mark, which authorizes you to plunder and sink the ships of our enemies. As this map will show, the nearest enemy city is the Spanish city of San Juan, which lies a long distance to the west. Okay. I'm about to send the brig Queen Mary to blockade San Juan. Perhaps you would like to tag along and pluck a few Spanish prizes. Good day. Okay, I don't think I'm going to do that anymore. <laughs> that was too annoying to try to do that. Okay, before we go, let's get some food. Eight months worth. Perfect. Shipwright, what will he offer here? Fine grain pattern. Good to know. The thing is, I don't really want to keep this ship. I want to get... Ooh, Brig of... Okay. Okay. Usually when I play this game, I like getting a bigger ship. Like a Brig of War is good. I usually go for... See, this is one of the reasons why. I can only hold 75 crew right now. If I get a bigger ship, like a frigate, or a war galleon, or a Brig of War, I can fit so many more troops in. Or, I guess troops, or sailors in there. So... I think I'm going to betray the English. Get myself a nice brig of war. Governor, what do you have to say? At war with the evil Spanish, peace treaty with the French, blah blah blah. Okay. Now let's get this military payroll. I don't usually betray the English, but, you know, I think it might be worth it. Because I've actually, actually rarely, oh god, come on. Are you going to turn or not? Shit, I had a number lock on. God damn it. Okay. 
Oh yes, please, by all means ram into me. Oh, you're not ramming into me. Okay then, that's uh, not ideal, but we'll ram into you then. Oh, okay, good. Oh, uh, could have been bad. Okay. Your ships collide with a mighty crash. As your crew rushes to attack, the enemy captain approaches with his sword drawn. Select your weapon. Well, let's do a rapier. I like the quick attack. Um, I find that I don't really need a quick defense. And longsword, I find, is just kind of useless all around. Rapier, I like a lot. Jump. Ah, shit. How did I... God damn. <laughs> Maybe the cutlass does have some use. Okay. And look at this. See my crew on the bottom right? They... So many of them die. It's, it's like... This is why it'll be nice to have um, a bigger ship. Like the one I just took. So that I can... Get... Uh, like I have a large amount of crew. Oh, that's so much gold. Oh, boy. Excuse me. Okay. Now, I think we have a new flagship. We'll call this one. Whoops. Shit. What do I do there? Okay. You will be... God damn it. What am I doing now? Why did it... Okay. Alright. This is the one. Tetrarch. Excellent. And it looks like we have a pirate hunter already. But I can't tell where. Is it... France? I didn't even do anything to you. Why are you attacking me? Alright, we'll fight you. Fuck you, man. Or... I don't even know French. I was trying to think of a French slur, but I couldn't. Okay, that works for me. Oh. Okay, you're back. Hello there. Hello there. God damn it. Such a small ship. Oh. Oh, fuck. Throwing the needles hard on this ship. Ah. Let's do that. Rape you again? Let's fight you, dude. So, I will say, in this game, I've actually never found my family. I've never done the quest line. Like, I've... To those of you who are familiar, like... I've, I've fought Baron Raimondo, but usually I'll just get wrapped up in, like, sacking cities. Like, usually what I'll do is I'll focus... Oh my god, another one. I think it's this one. Okay. Um, fucking hell. Oh, this is bad. Um, usually what I'll do is I'll focus on sacking cities and being a, more of a pirate than just a guy who's seeking revenge. So it's like, it, it doesn't... <laughs> this, this campaign could be the first time I've ever found my family. Which would be a learning experience, I guess. It'll be new for me. I think I'm just going to try to run away here. Because this is not going well. I'm very heavily damaged. I have only 40 crew. The question is if I can go fast enough. I'm at 12 knots. They're both at 11 knots. So if this stays the same way, 13 to 12 to 11, if this stays the same way, then I can escape. I hope. I really hope so. Okay, good. Thank goodness. Yeah, pirate hunters are annoying. Ah, oh, god damn it fucking rocks okay let's see if the French will take us in this is good too oh really you fucking sent a pirate at hunter after me you assholes well we could attack this merchantman while we're here do that. I could really use some repairs. But this ship only has six cannons on it, so 
I'm not too afraid of it. I just love the combat system in this game. I especially love sacking cities. Okay, so they want... Uh, I don't know what they want. I can't tell if they're trying to ram me. But we'll just shoot them a little bit. There we go. I love doing that. When you destroy enough of their crew, they'll just surrender. Alright, I'll take some crew. But I won't take this ship on. It's just a merchantman. Another one. Alright. By all means, please leave. <laughs> so where do we want to go? Ironically, this is one of the few games where the, I don't attack the Spanish at the start. So I guess one of their ports would be an ideal place. <sighs> hmm. Spanish smuggler of little pinnace. I could go south, but I kind of want to follow. Trade galleon looks so tempting. They're so easy to kill, but I think I'm going to go into port first. How far are we away? I think we go towards Caracas or Cur Curacao. I think that's how you pronounce it. I don't speak Dutch, so I don't know the whole pronunciations and stuff, but you know, let's look at our spyglass, and you use that by right-clicking. Don't really see anything. Don't see any city or anything. But from the map, I think we're going the right way. Caracas. Okay, let's avoid those rocks this time. Hello there, Trey Galleon. Where are you going? Trinidad, okay. Very nice. A modest Spanish port, but look at the amount of troops. That's more like a wealthy capital, if I were to say anything about it. <laughs> Tavern. Let's do this. Ah, 48 men. Welcome aboard, mates. I mean, I don't really usually care about this stuff, but... Only 60 soldiers, huh? Well, it looks like I could sack the Bahamas. The governor's daughter. Hmm. Let's talk to the governor. See, every game I play, I'm not usually friendly with the Spanish. They're usually kind of slimy. Um, we were at war with the perfidious English, the slimy French, and the greedy Dutch. Okay. So really, anyone I attack will get me on the Spanish's good side. Ah. Uh, excellent. The king will be pleased. Haha. I'm a captain. Oh, wow. She is quite beautiful. And yes, I am quite a handsome young ruffian. I think that you could get married one day. I also have never gotten married in this game. I've never figured out how. I, I, granted, there's a wiki, of course, but like, I wanted to try. Like in another game I've been playing, I've been trying. And I go on all these fucking dances with her. And I do well in the dance. Sometimes. Most of the time. Most of the time, but, uh... <laughs> then she'll like she had me fight her fiance and shit and then she had me do all of this other stuff so it's kind of annoying and I never got married Spanish royal galleon oof but I just talked to the governor I think I'll just I'll side with him for now part of me wants to be a marauding pirate that just attacks everybody but um I don't want to do it all the time especially at the start okay medicinal herbs see this is what i was talking about like i could i could have prolonged my life but i get so many items that do it anyway and gold is like contrary to what you might think gold is pretty easy to come by in this game like you can just sack a couple cities you can raid a few ships you can get easily get more than 2500 so i'll take it no reason not to really Ooh. Yeah, that's pretty good. One thousand's not, not too much to scoff at. Or, yeah. Okay, it could be a major for the Dutch. Interesting. Fine green powder. Powder, excellent. Okay, let's go. Now. Or no, that was another Spanish governor. I don't know why I said he was Dutch. I don't know why I thought he was Dutch. Okay. 
<clears throat> Dutch merchantmen. Let's see, how many soldiers does Curacao have? Oof, okay, I think I'm going to be friendly with them for now, not attack the city. What are you bound for? Curacao. Ugh, on the one hand, I want to kill those immigrants. But on the other hand, I want to get troops and information. Barbados? Sure. Okay. Looks like I'm not taking that town. 760 soldiers. That's ridiculous. Like, I could... I could probably get, like, 500 if I had... Uh... Like, seven ships. <laughs> if that. And, um... Still be outmatched against that city. So that's ridiculous. Okay. Even though I can't really attack that town, I will attack these immigrants. I would hope they have some money. Ah, one cannonball, what's it gonna do? Ah, they missed. Oh shit, I missed too. <laughs> God damn it. Okay. Now we will hit him. Oh, serpentine. Oh, fuck. Okay, that works out though. One more shot. One more shot. That's good. They're basically neutered. So let's go in there. With luck, they'll just strike the colors when we get there. Alright. Excellent. One of the Dutch crewmen is a skilled sea maker who can make sail repairs at sea. Good to know. He is quickly persuaded to join our crew. Yes, I think that is an excellent way to persuade someone to work for you. Sinker. We don't need immigrants on our crew. Ah, goddamn. And I don't hate immigrants, it's just like... What are they going to do for me? It'll just be more mouths to feed, and I'm a pirate, goddammit. Okay. This is what I hate about pinnaces. They are impossible to hit. They are so fucking fast. And if you start to beat them, they'll just run away. So it's like, there's no real reason to stay in that fight. Um, hmm. So now I think... Where could I go now? Part of me wants to go to Florida. I do live in Florida. So maybe that'll be where our journey takes us. I'm surprised I haven't really gotten any missions yet. Usually by this time I get to told about like one of the notorious pirates or something like Baron Raimondo or stuff like that. That's okay though. The more cities we go to, the more likely we'll get that information. Actually, I think I'll stay in the coast of South America just so I can go to more cities or stay near it, I guess. I really am dictated by where the wind is pointing over here. Because if I were to go this way, per se. Usually the speed will be slower. I don't know why it didn't change there. But usually it would go significantly slower there. Actually, I am going faster. It's just like the four knots doesn't say it. Well, either way. Let's go to... Rio de la Hacha. Is that it? Yeah. <clears throat> oh, hello there. Or hola. Poor Spanish port. Okay. Ooh, my crew's getting a little upset. That's fine. If they do get really upset, I might just betray the Spanish. Just so we get a good raid in. Ooh, nobody de Dios. Okay, Panama. 200 soldiers. Sackable. That's really all I care about when I say that. Okay, Captain Kidd. Oh, he's right by me. Maracaibo. And he carries over 6,300 doubloons. The governor here stinks. <laughs> so that's a, a mission I could do. Okay. Rather plain daughter, hmm. Man. That nose, though. Blah. Nah. Nah. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, sir, for insulting your daughter and you. I hope you can forgive me. Okay, you forgave me. Just 
repair that. It is nice to have one ship as a backup. I kind of like to have just one ship to sort of like role play. Like I'm the pirate, I have one ship. But it is sometimes nice to have an extra ship because if you if you lose a ship a naval battle or something you will you won't die you'll just get stranded on an island but if you or sometimes you'll get arrested actually um but other times you will get um well other times if you have a spare ship you will get uh you'll move to that ship okay this is one of the other things though i've noticed when you have more than two ships your crew gets really pissed and they're far more likely to mutiny so I think in the interest of that they're going to mutiny I don't really care about the cargo it's just a little bit of food I will discard or abandon that ship whoops why is that on the top that's weird okay I don't want you guys to desert oh there he is there he is I've actually seen him lose once. There was one time where I saw two pirates fight. Like, it was like, uh, I think it was Morgan versus Blackbeard or something, and one of them won. <laughs> and he just died. I didn't even get to kill him. It's kind of funny. Okay, man. If you really want to fight, I just grape shot on you. If you really insist on getting close, let's use a rapier. I love the. Uh, scenes for these pirates. It's so funny. Yeah. So he's got a cutlass. So his defense is great, but that means his attack is really slow and I can just easily dodge it and attack him. Just taunt him. See, it's like, this is not even a challenge, you know? This is why I think when I'll divide the plunder, I'll do swashbuckler. Because that'll be far harder. See you, buddy. Look at that gold. Yeah, this Brig of War actually has quite a bit of upgrades, so I think I'll keep it. See you, buddy. Okay, let's visit the tavern. <laughs> Welcome aboard, lads. <clears throat> Amazing news in my family. Tell me more. My sister. Puerto Bello. Okay. Well, I think that'll be a good mission to pursue. I'm the eighth most notorious pirate. Okay. Fear not, madam. Ooh, only 600 gold? That's ridiculous. What kind of pirate is he? No wonder he's number nine. Whoops, I didn't talk to the bartender. Okay. Good to know. Let's talk to the captain. Ooh, okay. I have a special hatred for the English for some reason. Probably because I attacked them first. Let's pick sink kits. Plunder awaits. Anything over here? Nope. Let's go. Okay, and looking at the time, I'm actually going to save this and end it. So, thank you all for watching. If you have any suggestions on what you'd like to see, um, how you'd like the, if you have any criticisms or compliments, please by all means, let me know in the comments. And let me know what you'd like me to do. Like, I'm just... I literally just turned this game on and I thought, okay, I'm just going to record a YouTube video. Let's see what it's like. So, let me know what you want me to do and I will do my best to do it because I really want to make this fun for me and for you guys. So, I will see you later.